Oh my god, it's on manual, fuck. Alright, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be watching Game of Thrones Season 6, Episode 4. Now, in the last episode, a quick... A, cli a quick summary. Ramsay has Osha and Rickon in his capture now, so... Uh, it's kind of sucks. He was forming an alliance. He was trying to form an alliance with somebody else. He basically formed an alliance with somebody else in the north, you know, so they can because they know that John has all the took all the wildlings and they're gonna come to Winterfell pretty soon. You know, like that was well John fucking left the Night's Watch actually, so I don't even know what the fuck's not gonna happen then. I don't know what John's gonna go and do actually. I was going to say he was probably gonna take all the wild he was gonna take the wildlings and go get winterfell and everything and go fucking kill ramsey but he left so i don't even know he left after he hung he hung were responsible for fucking killing him so <sighs> okay yeah i'm gonna stop wasting time we're just gonna hop right into this episode if you'd like to watch the full length reaction that will be available on patreon as well early access to the next two episodes of game of thrones will also be available on patreon so let's get started get warm Mmm, great idea, John. I was with you at hard home. Yep. We saw what's out there. Yeah, we have to do something about it. You can't leave. How can you leave us now? Yeah. After the night's watch, I gave my life. For all and they killed me. They <laughs> killed me, Ed, my own brothers. Yeah. You want me to stay here after that? Well, the ones who were responsible for it, they're dead now. Well, I mean, there's a lot more than just four people responsible. Who the fuck is here? <gasps> it's Sansa and Brian and Bob. They made it. Yes, they made it. Damn, they got there faster than I was anticipating them to be here. Damn. Wow, good thing John hasn't left yet. Damn, he was literally about to leave, but nope. Maybe he stays now. <gasps> yes. <sighs> this feels this feels great. Yes. Yes. Finally. <laughs> Dude, it's been so long. They literally haven't seen each other since season one. Oh my god. And she's gonna tell him about Ramsay. He's gonna go fucking kill Ramsay. Not anytime soon, but he's gonna he's gonna go eventually. She's gonna be like, yeah, he's a fucking problem and you have to do something about him, so. I want to yeah. scream at myself, don't go, you idiot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where will you go? Yeah. So. Where will we go? Oh, where are we going? If I don't watch over you, father's ghost will come back and murder me. Yep. You have to take her with you now. Well, you have to protect her. There's only one place we can go. Home. No, well, Ramsey's there. Bro. Wants to back up and leave. We'll take yeah. it back from them. Yes. Yes, we will. I don't have an army. You have the wildlings. Things did you save? They didn't come here to serve me. They ah. Lives. Bro, they will fight for you, I guarantee it. To fight for it. I'm tired of fighting. Aww. And I admire, I hanged a boy. Mm -hmm. Younger than Bran. Yeah. I fought, and I lost. I mean, you didn't take a real loss. I want you to help me. Mm hmm But I'll do it myself if I have to. Alright, I'd love to hear it, Sansa, but... Fuck, come on, John, you gotta do it. You gotta take back Winterfell. For Ned. For Ned. Do as Jon Snow commands. You sure Jon Snow now? Yep. He's the prince that was promised. Oh. He's the prince that was promised. What do you mean by that? What happened down there? There was a battle. Stannis was defeated. Yeah. And Shireen. Ah, uh, he doesn't know yet. Happened to the princess. Ah. Uh. My lady, I'm Sir Davos Seaworth. We've met before. I was King's guard to Renly Baratheon. Yep. Before Renly was assassinated with blood magic. Uh. <laughs> yeah, that's it, in the past. We gotta focus on what's coming. Doesn't mean I forget. Mm. Or forgive. Oh. Stannis. Just before I executed him. Mm hmm. Damn. 
That was great. That was great. So much beef between them right there. Just, oh my god. Why, why, what are we doing with Robin, bro? Oh my god, he's still a wimp. He's been training since the last time we saw him. And he still can't, oh, okay. That means we'll probably get a Baelish update, though. See what the fuck he's been up to. We haven't seen him in a minute. Nah. Here we go. I missed your name day. Go on. <gasps> Fingers, we were set upon by a large force of Bolton men. Mm. When we were traveling and exactly whom we were transporting. Do you take me for a fool? Yes. That's why he's lying. Your home is the Vale. The Lord of the Vale stands before us. And only his judgment concerns me. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, because his judgment. <laughs> Should we throw him through the moon door? Oh. Oh. To your father, to your mother, and now to you. Dude, he's too focused on the spell. Leave him, Uncle Peter. Yeah, see, he loves Peter, bro. He would make a capable commander in the wars to come. <sighs> Fine. Wow. That was close. Holy shit. Bro, yeah, Peter has Robin like this, so it's like... Okay, I expect she's headed to Castle Black where her brother serves as Lord Commander. Mm -hmm. But she won't be safe there. <laughs> Not with the Boltons after her. She's my cousin. We should help her. That was my instinct as well. Yeah, he was li no. He was literally about to be like, she's my cousin. Fuck that bitch. <laughs> but then... The time has come to join the fray. All right, let's fucking go. Invite the enemy into our city. I did. We make peace with our enemies, yes. not our friends. I bought this dwarf for a single gold honor. Somehow, you've risen to the top of the Great Pyramid of Marine. <laughs> Funny. Yeah, because you didn't know who he was, though. That's why. There haven't been slaves in Westeros for hundreds of years, and I grew up richer than any of you. Hmm abolishing slavery overnight we will give you seven years to end the practice hmm she doesn't like that you will not receive a better offer damn Jemo C. John Bagon oh, it's a fat time perhaps I should translate for you yeah <laughs> until she returns from her travel when does she return dude we don't fucking know hey just peace we should take it you know that these men are... How can you trust them? I do not trust them. I will never trust them. You have Sylvia As a wise man once said, We make our peace with our enemies, not our friends. <laughs> That's what Tyrion said. Yeah, all right, she trusts Tyrion. Keep slavery. For a short time. Seven years is not a short time. For yeah, it's not. I can't do both today. You are wrong to trust mm -hmm. these men. I trust their self-interest. Yep. They'll underestimate us every time, and we will use that to our advantage. You will not. They will use you. That is what they do. Don't let a science fool you. It's hard enough for me, and I'm a young man. Shut the fuck up. I don't think your heart could take it. Shut the fuck up. Oh, they found it. What are you doing? It's forbidden to carry weapons in the sacred city. Uh -huh. We're asking a dog to hand over his teeth. There's a hundred thousand of them down there. We can't fight our way out. Uh, it's risky, but... I'm very attached to this knife. You can, you can get it later, don't worry. Wow, nice handle. You would have that as a handle, bro. Oh shit, he saw it. Damn, it looks horrible. You know what happens? I know what happens. Damn, damn I wonder how bad it is like under your sleeve. Is it like more up his arm now? Because... Haven't seen his arm exposed in a minute. I should have been born of Dothraki. <laughs> Yanni. Mm, you should. It's bold. We wonder if Durgan got lost. Could you show us the way back? What do you sell? Wine. You're not merchants. Get the others. Oh, fuck. God damn it, Jorah. Oh, no, Jorah. No. Dude, Jorah's about to lose. We have. I feel like Dario still has a weapon somehow. Like, oh, oh, broke the fool's neck. I, uh, I guess he doesn't. I guess he didn't. I guess he actually didn't. <laughs> Try to hit him with the Tony Ferguson. Oh, 
my god, Dora, no way! Yeah. Yep. But, oh, he still brought a weapon. Yep, I knew it. Very attached to this knife. Yep, I knew it. Yeah, yeah good fucking thing he brought it. Stab wound. The whole city will be looking for us. Fuck, what do you do, though? Where do you hide it? Oh. To make it look like he died a different way? Alright. Hopefully that works. They're a stupid old woman. They don't realize we always diluted our blood. A year later, she wore her cowl. A daughter. How does she know? He broke my ribs. It, wow. We are not queens here, but the cause depends on for our wisdom. The other possibilities are not so pleasant. I need to make a water. You can't run from Darth Rocky. You know this. I'll never run from the Darth Rocky. Watch me, bitch. I'm about to be out of here in an hour. I need a fresh air. The old women stink. They do stink. You must have been very young when your call died. Too bad he didn't die sooner. <laughs> yes, too bad. Is it true you have three dragons? Hell yeah. Oh! Perfect. That's perfect. Damn, I was about to say, they were all the, they were all the way in the city. Damn, perfect. We will never get out of face Dothrak track alive. All we can do is try. Yeah, we gotta go. Fuck this, I'm not staying here. You're going to help me. I wouldn't kill her, I'd bring her with us. That's quite Have faith in me, Khaleesi. Do not betray me. Ah. Alright. Marge. If I were to let you leave right now, where would you go? What would you seek out? Back to the king, so I never see you again. Seeking out your family means seeking out sin. Shut the fuck up! Come. Let's go and see him. Oh? Loris? Loris. Is he dead? No, he's good, he's good. I can't stay strong. Ah. Oh. I never was strong. You are strong. Yeah, you are. Yes, you are. Ah, <laughs> oh, I feel so bad. <laughs> <sighs> he seems broken. Like his spirit just completely broke. <sighs> Don't worry, just stay strong. You'll get the fuck out of here. I... If Cersei can get out, you can get out. Don't hurry. You are beset with enemies, both within and without. What are you doing? Yeah, why are you here? Why are you talking to my fucking son? Current predicament. Leave. I am a member yeah. of the small country. I don't give a fuck. Bro, hurry up. <laughs> Hustle, bro. <laughs> get out of here. I've been thinking about the High Spire. That's how we all have. Are you gonna kill them? Of course. Marjorie's safety is paramount. You don't like Marjorie, do you? Uh, fuck no. No respect for anything in this world. He has no use nope. for the things of this world. There's something I want to tell you. Hmm. You can always trust me. <laughs> I don't know. No, oh, okay. For our father, because he understood the necessity of working with one's rivals. My dear. Now the future of the Seven mm. Kingdoms rests in his dirty peasant hands. Yep. But before that, Queen Marjorie will make her walk of atonement. Yep. Marjorie will repent her sins before the good people of the city. Yep. Do you want to make her do that? Or, yeah, you don't want her that to do that? cannot happen. Yeah, let's go fucking get her then. Let's that go bring her out. That happen. I agree. Yeah. Let's go break her out, kill everyone there. We've got the second largest there army we go. in the West. Perfect. Yeah. We'll bring them into the city. Stop Queen Marjorie's humiliation before it starts and take her back into crown custody. Thank you, dude. You better agree. He used to take no action against the High Sparrow or the Faith Militant out of fear for the Queen's safety. You will take Bro. no action at all. If we just fucking press them, there's nothing they can do. They what? You hate what they've done to your son. Do you want Lancel back? Or have you given him up for good? Yeah. And stand aside. And let the people that took him from you be destroyed. Yes. Yes. The sparrows have many friends in this city. We'll have civil war. Many will die. <sighs> we'll die no matter what we do. Yeah. 
All right, that's what I like to hear. Let's fucking- I cannot wait for that. I can't wait for that. Can't wait to see everyone in the High Sparrows just get waxed. They told me you were home and I didn't believe it. Oh, shit. Theon Greyjoy, I said. He's dead. Nah. Nah. Look at me. Men died trying to rescue you. Yeah. And you didn't want to go. My brother and I risked everything for you. Mm -hmm. And you betrayed me. I know. I mean... <sighs> kinda, yeah. He broke me. Oh yeah, he broke it. Oh yeah, 100%. You think any Ironborn wants you to be king? No. After what you've done? No, but... He just wants to be home and be safe. Listen to you, you're the only one... That doesn't ever... matter anymore, stop crying! Aww. Tell me what you want. I want to be, I just want to be safe. Yeah, that was a, that was a tough conversation between them. Oh no, no. Why is he cutting the apple like that? Like, what? Should I give it a bath first? Yes, kill him. Please kill him. Yes. Snake him. Yes. 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 Oh, he he knew it. He knew it. Much better talker than Theon Greyjoy. Uh, I feel like I'm just gonna see it coming. They all do. He told me everything. Who helped them escape? Mm. And how she did it. Uh, uh, wow! He was ready with that. Fuck. Fuck. Damn, R.I.P. Osha. That is disgusting. That, that is, that, you are going to get fucking AIDS. He should be dead within a couple weeks from that. I should kill him very soon. That is, that, he did not clean that knife good enough. But damn, R.I.P. Osha, bro. <laughs> A letter for you, Lord Commander. I'm not Lord Commander anymore. No, oh. I guess no one, no one else has officially been named Lord Commander. I, fuck, I don't know whose banner that is. To the traitor and bastard Jon Snow. Hmm. It's probably from Ramsay. You betrayed your own kind. You've betrayed the North. Mm -hmm. Winterfell is mine, bastard. Yeah, it's from Ramsay. Yep. Your brother Rickon is in my dungeon. Yep. Yep, John. John, you gotta do something now. It's a war now. And slaughter every wildling man, woman, and babe living under your protection. Bad torment. He torment hears that right. He's like, I will kill this fool myself. Then I will spoon your eyes from their sockets and let my dogs do the rest. Come and see, the warden of the north. Dog, dog. Oh wait. It's bad for Ramsey. It's bad for him. How many men does he have in his army? I heard him say 5,000 once when he was talking about Stannis' attack. Hmm. How many do you have? Yeah. March and fight. 2,000. Fuck! Fuck. Uh, children and old people. Yeah. Fuck. Fuck, what do we do? What do we do? The last true warden of the North. Northern families are loyal. They'll fight for you if you ask. Fuck. Will they, though? We have to go back to Winterfell and save them both. Yes. Yes. Yes, John. Yes. Fuck. We need, we need some help, though. What are we gonna do? We can't... We need... Ah, uh, okay. We don't have enough wild things. Fuck. Fuck it, go hit up Khaleesi. Go hit up fucking Daenerys, bro. Let's go to try and hit her up and see if she's down for this. I think she would be. She would, I mean, like, she doesn't know any of us, but Tyr she's with Tyrion. And Tyrion knows Sansa, so maybe he can convince her or some shit. I mean, yeah, there's probably other houses that, like, I'm not thinking of that could help them fight, too, but... Don't you want to know what I think? You'd rather be sold into slavery. Or maybe you'd like to be shown Rocco here what you taste like. 
No. I don't want either of those things. We don't care what you want. This is the temple of the Dashkalin. You have no voice here, unless you are Dashkalin, which you are not, until we decide you are. I know where I am. I've been here before. This is to pronounce my child, the stallion, mounts to the wall. And what happened? Just a sorceress like a fool. Eh. The baby's dead because of you. So is Cal. You are small men. None of you are fit to lead the Dothraki. I am. But I am. Oh, let's go. So I will. She's not even faced. We'll give our horses a turn. Bitch. Got me fucked up. Do you really think we'd all serve you? Hmm? You're not going to serve. You're going to die. Oh! Yep. Fuck him. Yep. Yeah, and she could just stand in the fire road. She's chilling. Waxed. She's gonna walk out unfazed. And then I guess, yeah, they're all gonna follow her now. Sick. Yep. Evan Daria. This is the first time Daria has seen this, too. Sick. All right. Well, that was season six, episode four. Bro, Ramsey has me so fucked up right now. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Alright, so that was Game of Thrones Season 6, Episode 4. Oh my god, dude. Ramsey has me so fucked up. Oh my... I hate this fool, dude. I, I, I think I hate this fool more than Joffrey. Ugh. I can't wait, bro. I cannot wait. Okay, so, okay, I think I know what happens eventually because I remember a little bit ago somebody left a comment mentioning the Battle of the Bastards, right? And, like, now, okay, now it makes sense, right? And, like, I didn't want to, like, think about that too hard because I was like, no, I'll just let the story unfold in front of me and see where it goes. But, okay, now it makes sense. So, there's a battle coming eventually. I hope it's the finale of this season because I fucking hate Ramsey, bro. Oh my god, he is just testing us. He is testing us. But what are we gonna do? Our armies, we have, it's 2,000 versus 5,000. What are we gonna do? We need to go get someone else. Like, we need another house to join us. Now, like, the only other place I could really think of is Daenerys, but she's busy with her own stuff right now. <sighs> And like, why would she even come and help us? And like, unless she just like, have the kindness of her heart, it was like, yeah, sure, I'll come do that for you, you know? And like, maybe, maybe if they reach out to her, you know, Tyrion will be like, oh, Sansa's with them. Okay, I'll do this. I'll convince Daenerys for Sansa or something like that. Like, mm, I don't know. That's probably not gonna happen. So, but I fucking hate they, They'll probably just find another house that like, I'm that I just don't know of at the time or like I should know but I'm sure there's other houses that like yeah I should know of that they'll reach out to but I don't off the top of my head I can't think of another house they could reach out to but I'm sure that's what they'll do so it would be nice to have Khaleesi's because well she just gained the Darth Raki on her side now you know and Jory did say there's at least a hundred thousand of them here but obviously not all of them are gonna fight like out of the ones that can fight, well, like, take out the women and children, probably still got, like, a solid 30,000. So it's like, all right, I feel like just even the Unsullied joining us would be, that would be perfect. That would be enough already, so. But that's probably not going to happen, so. But, but I'm so happy Sansa can find, they got to the Night's Watch. I'm so happy they didn't miss each other by, like, a fucking day or something like that. Because, like, John, he was about to leave at any given second. You know, if he left, uh, if Sansa got there like two days, like a day or two days later, she would have missed him. I mean, do you think they would have shot each other as they're going and as he's leaving? Probably not. I don't know. Depends if they're on the same route, just going to, you know, maybe, I don't know. 
but whatever. I'm happy they finally got to see each other again. <sighs> it's nice. John hasn't seen her since she joined the Night's Watch. Since season one, it's it's nice. It's been nice. This is nice. This is really nice. But okay, and then Ramsey sent her sent them that fucking letter saying like, yeah, I have Rickon. I have your come see him. I have your dire wolf. Come see him. Blah blah. He's like, give me back Sansa, or I'm gonna do all these awful things. You know, and then Ramsey was like, if you don't give her back, I'm gonna come to the Night's Watch. I'm gonna kill everyone there and kill all the wildlings and do all these uh, other awful things. And like, bro, Torment was fucking pissed hearing that, dude. He was like, oh, bet. He like his face. Oh my god, that was that was so good to see. That was so good to see. That got him fired up. He was like, oh, I'm I'm going. Like John, where we better go and kill him right now, dude. I don't know. Like, okay, the odds. John is the underdog in this, but like, I I'm put. I'm putting my money on John to win this. John to win in this. No, no chance. He doesn't win. John has, John has only ever won. Well, I guess he technically lost a hard home, but like still, it's like John. John's a dog, bro. I will never bet against him. I mean, he did take an L when he got killed, but like still, that's like that's not a real loss because he was killed by his own people and he was just snake. It wasn't like he lost like legitimately. So, all right. So then back at King's Landing. <sighs> okay, so they had a small council meeting where Cersei, she's trying to convince them to do something about it, about stopping the High Sparrows, and her leverage was like, look, Marge is gonna have to do that walk of shame. Do you want to see her do that? No, you don't. Let's go fucking kill all of them, you know? And then, you know, she was telling Tywin's brother, Kevin? You know, she was telling Tywin's brother, like, look, let's go get your army, and let's go fuck, let's bring him here, and let's go wipe this fucker out, okay? You're the hand of the king. We gotta go and fucking do this, Okay. Tommen has no fucking nuts right now, okay? He's like 15. We we need to do this for him, okay? I can't wait till that happens either. I cannot wait to see. But, you know, obviously, they don't want to try and press him and attack, and then they just kill Marge or something like that. So that's their leverage in this. But, dude, if we just sneak... If we have a sneak attack, like, they'll never see it coming. Like, dog, all they have is... They're literally just in fucking robes and nunchucks. Like, that's all they have, bro. We have fucking soldiers. They We're gonna wax them. But then obviously, but then Elena said that like, yeah, you'll, he has many allies in the city and like, it will start a civil war. But yeah, that's kind of the only, like, I say that's like the only con and like, maybe Marge could die in the process and Loras could die. But really, I don't see them dying. I think like, I think we could do it and get them out. Probable con is a civil war potentially. Oh, fuck him. This city's already fucked anyway. Oh, wait, 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 wait. You know what I just realized? Okay. I was skimming through the episode to see if, like, there's anything I missed. You know, like, what I could talk about next. Because, you know, a lot happens in these episodes. And, like, off the top of my head, I'm gonna forget stuff. So, I was skipping through it. I totally forgot about the scene with Baelish and Robin. Yeah, Baelish was, like, to Robin, like, yeah, you know your cousin Sansa? We should help her. And then Robin was like, okay, we'll help her. So they're gonna go help us so that's gonna be the house that joins us okay there we go problem solved i uh, how much help is the veil gonna be i'm not sure but it's better than nothing so okay that's that's our solution and then okay then over with Tyrion in the city he talked all he talked to the masters you know and he made them a deal he's like look we'll give you seven years to abolish it which Okay, like obviously we, we want to abolish it overnight. That is best case scenario, but at the same time we we need to give them time to do it and so they could I like Tyrion said they, they could adjust or whatever. You know, if we if we basically say like look, you have to get rid of it by tomorrow, that's a threat and a war is gonna start, you know? And like I feel like Tyrion was trying to handle that, like how Tywin would, you know? But he's not as like slick as Tywin would probably would have handled that situation, you know? And he's kind of losing the city over it. Like they pressed him right after they right after they left the room, you know? And it's like, well, yeah. And Grey Worm doesn't agree with it. Grey Worm, he like Grey Worm. It seems like he'd rather go to war. He just wants it to be over with now, and they don't want to give him seven years. So it's a tricky situation, you know. So we'll see how Daenerys handle, handles this when she gets back. So I don't know. Maybe I feel like she's not. I feel like she's gonna be kind of mad at Tyrion for making that offer. Like, no, seven years is way too long. <laughs> but look, she just got the Darth Raki. So maybe we will go to war. I don't know. We'll just see what, what happens with that. But anyways, that was Game of Thrones season six, episode four. Comment down below what you thought about this episode down below in the comments. And if you liked the video, like the video. And thanks for watching.